you were the youngest driver. You are the youngest driver to ever win a race in the series. What did that mean to you? I mean, everybody else told you that you were that, but what did it mean to you? It was, you know, it, it felt special just because, you know, I think more because it's my first ever win, but then also to be the youngest ever is, is pretty spectacular. Um, yeah, I was, I was really put into a great program my rookie year that I was able to win. We had cars to win, which doesn't happen to a lot of people. Um, so yeah, I mean, I gave a lot of props to the team for, for putting me in the position of that, but, but to be the youngest winner, it's, it's really cool. It's cool to be in the IndyCar, IndyCar record books, um, you know, for however long that may be, I think, you know, as, as people just keep getting younger and younger, I think my dad's rookie year is like 20, he's like 23 or 24. And that was relatively normal at the time. Whereas now guys are coming in 18, 19. So and I, I could see it getting even younger than that. So I wouldn't be surprised if, if down a few years that it gets broken. Colton, you made a lot of headlines recently when McLaren announced that you would test a Formula One car uh, for them. How long was that process in the making for you? Um, yeah, I mean, it was always a goal of mine was to be able to, to get in one of those cars and see what they're actually like. Um, so I'm very fortunate that Zach and Andrea Seidel and all the guys at McLaren have given me this, this chance to be able to, to kind of just dip my feet in and see what a, an F1 car is, is really like. And hopefully it's mutually beneficial and I can give good feedback on the car and something that they can use this year on their cars. But for me, um, yeah, it's, it's going to be so cool just to be able to finally get a hold of one of those things and, and see what I can do in it. When did Zach, uh, you, you've probably known Zach for a long time, I'm sure. He's, yeah. He's, he's been around the, he's been around the racing world. We've had him on this program talking about how long he was involved in IndyCar. When did Zach first approach you? When did you get to know him? Um, I probably first met Zach in maybe late 2018, early 2019, um, when they were looking at, at doing an IndyCar program, um, and so I, I got to know him through, through IndyCar in, in that aspect. And um, I actually came close to, to signing with them one year. And, and so obviously I had a lot of talks with Zach. But yeah, I think it, I don't remember exactly where I was and, and how it happened, but it all happened very fast about um, Zach said, you know, he's interested in, in letting me test one of their cars. And um, of course I was all for it because it's going to be a great opportunity for me just to get in one of those things. So, um, yeah, I'd known Zach for, for maybe three years now and, and never really talked about F1 with him. It's always been, um, you know, just talking about racing in general, cause he's such a, uh, a, a car head. So it's, it's, it's cool that he was, uh, you know, able to give me the opportunity to be, be testing his cars. <laughs> 